problems, man. And 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 the all this th- all this time stuff been going on, ain't no dope been moving. Nothing. Bro. That's what I'm like, bro. What a halt. It's all at a halt, bro. Everything all at a halt. Ain't all nothing the- moving. Got Reed it. ain't got no guns. Nothing, bro. It's the whole so, that stands here, bro. But they just went. They did go pick up a load. You know what I'm saying? But they ain't moved nothing. It's just been sit- just sitting in the warehouse somewhere because ain't nobody sitting. on the block unless they doing it in the project. Unless they moving it in the projects. Project ain't ain't, ain't bring ain't gonna bring them eight million a month. And no, ain't, ain't bringing no eight million. You know what I'm saying? Because last week they kind of set it up. Maybe they kind of moving in the projects, but it ain't, ain't moving their work around the city like he was moving it at first. Yeah, and Reed gonna be, and then oh, when this when this this article just dropped, we gonna need that money, so the government to be like, you know what, and just 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 let it go, like let's smooth it over, however we need to do to kill this story. But if Reed ain't giving them no incentive to kill a story, hey, what, what, what's gonna stop the government? Said, all right, we gotta get Reed about it. Yeah. He ain't he ain't, the whole- he ain't doing what he. He he he, he lost, yeah. lost in the sauce out there. Lost in the sauce. He let the article drop. He ain't bringing in no more money. Our our, our insurgents got slaughtered in in Guatemala. Can't get the guns. Yeah. He on coke. He, he coked up, man. It's, it's over. You know what I'm saying? But I wonder what's that? You know, they showed us that episode where uh, we saw the facts where you know Gustavo's girlfriend she moving around in different cities. I wonder how they gonna bring that to play in the last episode, or if they gonna bring Mel back in the next episode to kind of wrap up the season. And they can't bring Mel back, bro. It's too much. You go. They, they might bring Mel back the, the teasers though for the next season. You're right. They might bring Mel back. Bring Mel back. What what they gonna do with Wanda? You know, so I think Alton might be it might be his last season. That might have been just a way to kind of write him off the show because sometimes, man, he'd be on the screen. I'd be like, he kind of dragged us, kind of dragged the scene down a little bit. You yeah. know, the energy. I think all I think Alton already tried to kick knowledge and shit. Like you trying to kick knowledge? <laughs> Nobody want to hear that shit, man. We out here selling like, rock, nigga. <laughs> you money, we just yeah, money. What you doing, bro? Like you either yeah, yeah. or you against us, man. You either get down or you later. Lay down. He didn't come in to try to kick knowledge. Talking about you killing our people, man. If you don't get your, bro, I'm bringing the eight million dollars a month, bro. Trying to get this money. And then you know what I'm saying. Uh, uh, Reed was like, "You gotta, you gotta, how you go? How you go trust? Like, man, that's my pops, man. I thought I could trust my pops." Yeah. Hey, that's you see that hit Reed though. Reed, that shit stopped because Reed hit my because you know how Reed pops treating him. You know when he said that's my pops, you see Reed kind of paused like, like you know. All right. Like, bro, but, but honestly, like, you think you should be able to trust your pops. He's like, man, True. pops. Like, how can I not trust? Why would I not want to trust my pops? You know what I'm saying? Like, how you let this yeah. happen? And it was my pops, bro. Like, yeah. What you want me to do? I thought I could trust him. I thought I brought I- that man out the street sleeping up under the bridge. Hey, bro, he was all dope fiend out when I found him. When the, when the whole family didn't want him around. Remember? Moms didn't want him around. Jerome still on like the nigga really snitch your motherfucker. Remember the Jerome was like, yeah, if the CIA don't deal with him first, snitch your motherfucker. <laughs> hey, exactly. Jerome still don't like the nigga. Exactly. So, yeah, he he did that. He did that to Franklin and them. What I was hollering at, like, bro, I brought you in the house from out the cold. You were sleeping under the bridge, drinking Boone's Farm. You know what I mean? Like, you gonna do me like that? I gave you a shelter to run. Man, I, I saved your life. You know, that's what we basically say. Man, I saved your life. And this is how you repay me? This is yeah. how you, I saved your life? Man, yeah. I, I, man, that was cold, though. He did all that shit. He supposed to at least bring it up to least, least to Sissy. Maybe not to Franklin, but at least talk to Sissy. He had, the, he had a moment to do that, you know what I mean? When it was at, when it was at the bedside, when he, was, he had first came in, he had the opportunity to let him know, like, look, man, the reporter later, she know what's going on. I think we should kind of sit down. Let's talk about this, how we want to play this, blah, blah, blah. He kind of didn't say nothing and then go back. That's why when he came in the first time, he was like, you want me to go with you? You want to talk to the reporter later and not talk to me? You know what I'm yeah. saying? You that's, had your chance. And that's what, that's what I think that's what hurt her, you know what I'm saying, hurt her because she he, he chose a reporter over her without letting mm-hmm. her know about it. You know, he you, you didn't even give them an option to figure out what they want to do. You just go and talk to her, put the story out there, and then drop the bombshell and we're gonna run. Like, nah, bro, you ain't you ain't thought about it. you ain't considered me at no point at this at, you haven't given me no consideration of what I want. You know what I'm saying? Cause she always saying, if Franklin down with it, let's do it. If Franklin down with it, let's do it. Yep. Yep. I was yep. 
all of a sudden you're not you don't want to go to run through running by franklin you just want to do it on your own you're like man i know in his mind he like man i know what franklin is gonna say he's gonna talk me out of it or whatever whatever but i want to get i want to get this coke off the street it's too late bro it's in the streets yeah. yeah oh yeah hey bro you can't you can't put that toothpaste back in the tube bro it's out yeah <laughs> It's out, like you said. And it's out. Ain't nothing you can do about it, bro. Ain't nothing. This is our. It's too far gone. Too far. Too, that toothpaste, hey, bro. The toothpaste out the tube, bro. You can't put it back in. You got a tube, bro. Hey, you man, what, take that crack off the street if you want to, nigga. It's gonna be pandemonium in LA. Take you know, that rock off the street. The zombie land gonna go crazy around there. It's gonna be breaking into everything for that crack. Everything, bro. It's and, and, and like I said, frankly, it's too much money. Too much money. It's too much money. Time out to go walk away. I'm like an eight million a month, bro. And you yeah. think you just go walk away from this? Nigga said, "This is my home. I ain't looking over my fucking shoulder every time." <laughs> <laughs> I hit it like that when mom said she moving out of South Central, though. Oh yeah, that hurt him. It hurt him, bro. That kind of like it kind of like because like, that's his, that's his baby. You know what I'm saying? For his baby to kind of be like, uh, I don't know. I, I can't get in between you and your daddy no more. I'm tired of being in the middle. You're like, yeah. So you're like, we'll talk about that later. We'll talk about that later. Yeah, talk about that later. She was like, I'm moving out the house. She, hey, he sat his, sat his crippled ass back down on that one. He was like, oh, shit. Like, wait, wait, what'd you say? She's like, I'm moving. Like, what you, not without it. No going. Like, nah, I ain't going like you said. And, but still, he was like, hold on, hold on, hold on. But she's supposed to be up out of South Central, bro. Like, well, come on, Franklin. You can't be, you can't be having, you can't be slinging all that dope in the hood and the trap, and then have your mama still standing in the same little joint when you grew up in. You gotta have moms out. Can't be untouched with nobody supposed to know where mom stay at. Yeah, I'm like, bro, nobody supposed to know where mom stay at. It's like that's how you be slipping, frankly, because you niggas coming shooting at the nigga came shot the funeral. That supposed to be one of the first things, mom. You got to get up out of there, mom. Hit moms up, get pack a bag, go stay at the Four Seasons in in, in Santa Barbara somewhere. You know what I mean? Get out of LA, go stay in San Diego somewhere. And and you know what I mean? Go stay in Oakland or something. Go go to San Francisco. Bro, they come snatch, they come snatch mama up and kidnap mom dukes, hold her down for ransom. What are you gonna do? He gonna give what it. He gonna do. He gonna get a plug up, everything. Give everything up, bro. Like he gonna give it up. That's what I'm saying. Like you can't have he ain't thinking smart. They up in there just chilling, like eating, watching kung fu movies and all that. Like, bro, y'all out here selling too much dope to be out here just standing in the same spot y'all grew up in. Like, nah, bro. With no with no protection. No protection. Nobody at the front door, nothing. Y'all just up in there chilling. They come snatch up everybody, hold up the whole, hold up the whole house. Frankly, whole house. You finna give up everything, man, for more. You know, out and going, look here, brother. Why you trying to take us, bro? You know, that's what they ain't gonna do. Bro, nobody wanna hear that. Bad boy gonna run up in there with Scully. Nobody, they gonna, they gonna gun butt him just like it Franklin did. Right across, look here, we ain't got to do this. The black, the black man, bow, shut your ass up, bro. It's too late for all that talk, bro. Like, we trying to get this money, man. We trying to eat out here in these streets, man. You can't, man. Eat, these wolves hungry, man. You gotta feed them hungry. hungry. Ooh. Them young boys, them young boys are hungry, bro. Man boy, about to, hey, man boy, Scully come up in that house with that shit in his ear. You know, Scully put that shit in his ear, bro. He ain't trying to hear nothing. Got the choppers, them boys gonna come in there and wreck shop, bro. Bro, wreck shop, bro. Man, I don't, sh- man, this nigga Leon, Leon been kind of, he been quiet though, the whole time. But he better get low, he better get low and get quiet. You know what I'm saying? You know, he got that hit on his head. They, yeah, yeah. Good. they already said they like man we work hard to set this man up we thought dude leon hey they ain't yeah. come they trying they come at the funeral they ain't playing bro it's serious out there they serious they told us <laughs> leon was like they told leon to keep drone man you want me to ride with you in the drone like nah nigga, i'm going to get some air show ass down man he, he, he about he it did it did serious out there now for jerome first jerome man. Um, Jerome been on defense the whole time. Now he finna go get on the offense. He finna go, like I said, he finna go do some head hunting. He finna go get at somebody. He finna go get some yeah. blood. Hey, Jerome, about to, Jerome really about to bring the police over though. <laughs> he, about to bring, he about to be raised out going around there, man. Yeah. The police are going to be on his ass because he about to go shoot everything up. He like, man, go to the project. We finna go to the projects. We going to get to the barbershop. I'm killing everybody. Anybody at the barbershop. He finna kill anybody. 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 It's like, Shop. Just like just like you said earlier, that nigga said frankly what that nigga leaned in and said, fuck oh, frankly, my right <laughs> nigga. <laughs> hey, 
Hey man, they gotta get they gotta get Franklin off this cane, bro. He can't still be on the cane the whole season, bro. But a nigga must have got some brittle ass bones or some shit, bro. Like, what's wrong with this nigga bones? He ain't drinking enough milk, bro. This man, this got- nigga steady. Oh, and then every time you get up, ah, I'm like, nigga, what's wrong with you, bro? And then she in there rubbing his head and stuff, all trying to get him a massage. And, like, bro, you took three slow. You should be Gucci by now, man. Should be Gucci by now, nigga. That nigga Peaches and took a shot. And he back already, remember? That's right, he showed he, get sh- he got shot up in episode one or two. Yeah. He's at the warehouse where he got shot in the arm or something. He ready to go that night. Ready to go that night. Peach is over there, still ready to go. He would with, with, with the oversized brown suit on. Nigga, remember inside the funeral. Ready, <laughs> like, nigga, let's go, nigga, like, you know? Yeah. Hey, when they came popping, who was out there first? Nigga, Peaches. Peaches. Chasing at him, popping, wow, wow. Like, we, you know, he, he back in the arm and he ready. Granted, this nigga Franklin still with the cane. Falling down all crippling. Y'all soft cane, like see y'all yeah. soft soft bone. Man, you don't get your soft bone ass up, man. Come on, brother. Nigga, I'm like, what she shoot you with? Nigga, a desert eagle or some shit? <laughs> yeah. Bro, she putting three slugs in them, bro. You must have bled out up in there for a minute, bro. He must have bled out because of some, bro, because he shouldn't be still on that cane, bro. Even even Scully got hit in the shoulder. He ain't been back Gucci. Gucci, bro. Niggas, I'm like, come on, bro. This nigga, this nigga Franklin's soft all the way around. Nigga, they don't want to sit down to hit on niggas. Nigga call a reporter trying to try to kill the whole operation. Nigga want to go have a drink with her and shit. Man, motherfucker. Bro. Tim the bone around here, man. He Ree was like, Ree was like, what you what? You did you talk? Yeah, talk to her? <laughs> like, that, what ah oh, no, nah. he was like, man, get your ass out of here, man. He, Man, she ain't going for them empty threats like this. She gonna be took. Like, All right, I got him. I take care. That's what I'm saying, bro. Franklin, bro, he ain't. Hey, he ain't got it in him, bro. He be, he be aggressive. He's smart. He's smart as hell. He ain't aggressive enough. Nah, he don't. He don't be. Nigga, he don't. He don't. He don't send that. Uh, he don't send that. Uh, put that fear in people. He got that put, fear in people. You gotta put that fear. Yeah. Nah, you gotta go. You gotta go pop, pop, pop in front of somebody. Let them know like this. What this how it is. 